ओम शांति टुडे इज 4 अगस्त 2024 मधुबन अव्यक्त बाप दादा द प्रूफ ऑफ हैविंग एक्यूरेट रिमेम्बरेंस इज टू बिकम एन एम्बॉडीमेंट ऑफ पावर एंड सस्टेन अदर्स विद द पावर्स टुडे देयर आर मेमरीज इमर्जिंग इन एवरी वंस हार्ट From Amrit Vela, Bap Dada was being garlanded with a variety of garlands of love and remembrance by children everywhere. Together with that, Baba was also listening to the songs of love and remembrance from their hearts. In return, both Bap and Dada are garlanding the children with garlands of different powers and different blessings. This day of remembrance is a special day of Sun Shows Father. When the children came onto the corporeal stage through the blessing of being embodiments of power, this is because it is the day of making the children instruments for service on the corporeal stage, of seating the children on the throne, and giving them the crown of responsibility. it is the coronation day and the day for receiving the tilak of becoming instruments for doing service in the corporeal form all the children have become instruments who cooperate with the father and will continue to do so bap dada is also pleased to see the children move forward in doing service with zeal and enthusiasm Each child is moving forward number wise with courage zeal and enthusiasm the majority of children continue to remain engaged in having remembrance and doing service just as children everywhere especially today remain lost in love for father brahma so too father brahma also remains lost in love for the children today Father Brahma was looking at the specialties of the children as each child specialty appeared in front of Baba the words that emerged from the lips of Father Brahma were wah children wah well done children well done what happened then as Father Brahma was saying wah children and well done children the rivers gangas and jamuna of love were flowing from the eyes of all the children every child was lost in love in the river of love this was the scene in the subtle reason in the corporeal world too bab dad also saw scenes of love and remembrance at each place what do you now have to do you have remembrance but the proof of having accurate remembrance is that you become an embodiment of power through that remembrance remembrance is the extremely elevated when you became brahmins you received your birth right from bap dada with this awareness in a second your heart understood this your heart mind and intellect remembered i belong to baba and baba belongs to me through this awareness you received the rights to your birth right this awareness becomes the key to all powers this awareness is a golden key i belong to the father that is i am a soul how much time did it take for you to develop the faith that i am a soul a child of the father it took you time to do the course but how much time did it take you to develop faith it was a deal of just a second was it not you claimed your right to your inheritance in just a second all of you claimed your right to the inheritance have all of you claimed your rights or are you becoming those with all rights have you become those with all rights are you sure acha have you double foreigners claimed your right to the inheritance have you pandavas claimed your rights to the inheritance are you sure 
आर यू श्योर आर यू श्योर मैनी मैनी कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन टू दोज हु हैव ऑल राइट्स हैव यू स्पेशली रिसीव्ड ऑल द पावर्स एज अ राइट फ्रॉम द फादर If you have received these raise your hands you have received all the powers have you not or is it that some have received eight powers and others six powers you call yourselves master almighty authorities you don't call yourselves those with some powers but those with all the powers do all of you sitting at the front have all the powers Bab Dada is asking about the word all do all of you have all the powers or do some of you only have some powers is there anyone do any of you say that you don't have all powers but that you have some powers isn't there anyone none of you are raising your hands It is good that all of you are masters of all the powers. So, O oh masters of all the powers, Bab Dada is asking, do you have all the powers whilst facing every situation arising from the elements, from Maya, from your nature and sanskaras, and from the atmosphere? Have you made all of these five things? the elements maya your sanskaras the atmosphere and bad company subservient to you on the basis of having all the powers have you done this this is a snake with five heads do you dance on the five heads of this snake as one with all rights do you do this or does one of the heads emerge and dance on you even a snake can perform a very good dance can it not so no head of a snake comes to perform a dance on you does it do you sometimes like to watch its games do you get caught up in watching the games or have you made the five hats into a garland around your neck have you made the snake into a comfortable bed or a stage of dance on the snake shown as a garland around the neck is the memorial of your final stage of mahadev the great deity shankar a deity of tapasya a deity soul in the bodiless stage and an angelic soul when you wear this garland you receive a high number and become a bead that is closed in the father's rosary you become a bead that is closed in the rosary of victory bab dada also said earlier that now according to the time you especially need the power to tolerate and the power to face any problems or situations in your actions they are not only necessary for your thoughts and words but also for your actions Bab Dada has seen in the result that you do have the powers. It isn't that you have no powers; you do have them. But why is there a difference? There is a difference in your abilities to use the powers in the right way and at the right time. You do have the awareness, but you do not put that awareness into a powerful form. there is more awareness but sometimes there is less power and sometimes it is fine your awareness has enabled you to claim your right to the inheritance but it is the power of each aspect of awareness that makes you victorious and into a close bead in the rosary of victory become embodiments of those powers you do have them in your minds and intellects but you have to become an embodiment of each power and reveal all the powers in every task of yours you celebrated the day of remembrance very well now become embodiments of the powers whenever you look at others let them experience from your eyes your powerful form through each word of yours let others become powerful 
let them experience power let your words not be ordinary with every word give them the experience of the blessing of power that you have received with your mind and intellect your elevated thoughts and accurate power of decision making create a powerful atmosphere even in ordinary activity let your powerful form of an angel be visible let there be the experience of being double light for yourself and others is it like this therefore as you walk and move be an embodiment of power and give power to others today the father took father brahma on a tour where did they go baba showed father brahma all the brahmins in this land and abroad who took an avyakt birth after brahma baba became avyakt how many of these would there be the creation through the avyakt form is much larger than the creation through the corporeal form baba made the creation through the avyakt form at every place emerge in the subtle reason did you hear that all of you were also included in that were you not bab dada gave each one i filled with great love and the feeling of being close baba also gave a special gift to the avyakt creation those sitting here who have become part of the brahmin souls creation after the part of corporeal brahma ended raise your hands it is the majority of you acha you may put your hands down acha those who are the creation through the corporeal form raise your hands there are very few of you there are very few of you in today's gathering bab dada made each child emerge as the number was very large they would not be able to sit here but all of you can come to the subtle reason there you can have as much space as you want bab dada made everyone emerge in the subtle reason that is bab dada invited them there everyone was very happy and bab dada was even happier bab dada gave those jewels a gift it was a very beautiful lotus flower of loveliness diamonds sparkling very much each petal of the lotus had a different power written on it and each one was sparkling brightly with a different color let that lotus flower of flawless diamonds emerge how beautiful would it be did it emerge did you let it emerge did you double foreigners let it emerge did the teachers let it emerge did the pandavas emerge it did the very sweet mothers let it emerge the mothers are the specialty of this university what is everyone amazed about that there are so many mothers who have become shaktis so many mothers have adopted purity and changed into forms of goddesses you can see that the mothers are in the majority therefore today bab dada gave the avyakt creation a lot of love baba made a garden emerge in the subtle reason he also made mountains and an ocean emerge baba took your children everywhere you had freedom to go wherever you wanted he didn't make you play games he didn't makes you play with the bat and ball some were playing in the ocean waves some were sitting on the mountains and some were walking around in the garden so today there was a happy gathering of the avyakt creation in the subtle reason bab dada gave all of you this blessing constantly continue to live and fly with all the powers therefore bab dada special great mantra of today the day of remembrance is become an embodiment of remembrance and an embodiment of power don't keep your treasures incognito reveal them through every action give every soul who comes into contact with you through your eye your words and your actions cooperation so that they become powerful be in your powerful forms and give them love 
Pap Dada has seen that out of the new children that come, there are some souls who together with Bap Dada's cooperation also need to receive gares, zeal, enthusiasm and solution from you Brahmin souls. They are still very young. Although they are young, they have been courageous and become Brahmins. So the younger ones need the sustenance of the powers. It is not a question of giving power and sustenance separately, but there is a need to give power as a form of sustenance. The Brahmin souls that are needed for this establishment should become ready quickly because at least 9 lakh souls are needed. Therefore, give the cooperation of the powers. Give the sustenance of the powers. Increase the powers. Don't give teachings that will lead to more discussion. Give them power. Don't look at their weaknesses, but continue to fill them with whatever specialty or power they lack. Nowadays, there is a need for you instrument souls to be instruments to give this type of sustenance. It is common to increase the number of students and the number of centers, but there is now a need to make every soul powerful with help from the Father. All of you are serving and you cannot remain without serving. However, let souls now experience the vibration of your powerful form through the service you do. Let there be powerful service. In today's world, there are plenty who do ordinary service. However, your specialty is powerful service. Even Brahmin souls need the sustenance of power. Achha. All of the children of this land and abroad are in front of Bab Dada, even though they are far away. Bab Dada knows that all of you say the same thing. Also give my love and remembrance. Everyone's remembrance reaches Bab Dada, whether through letters, words, cards or emails. There are now many facilities of science. Bab Dada receives the remembrance through these facilities and also the remembrance through the sound of the heart. The sound of the heart reaches Baba the fastest. So to all of those who have sent love and remembrance from their hearts and through all the different methods, Bab Dada is also giving love and remembrance. Children give remembrance once and Bab Dada gives multi-million fold love and remembrance in return. Acha, to all the powerful souls everywhere who are close to the hearts, to the elevated souls who reveal each power at the right time through their forms, to the souls who constantly cooperate with the Father and become instruments to give souls the sustenance of all the powers, to the souls in the flying stays who constantly give everyone grace, zeal and enthusiasm, to the world transformer souls who constantly transform problems into solutions. To the souls who are embodiments of remembrance and therefore embodiments of power, Bab Dada's multi-million fold love, remembrance and namaste. Acha, today Baba is especially remembering those from Sangam Bhavan, Abu Road Center. Those from Sangam Bhavan have come. Their service is no less. Today, Bab Dada especially received their love and remembrance. The service of receiving others is no less. In fact, all the servers of Shantivan are ahead of each other in doing service. It is good. You have to stay awake. You have to keep moving. You have to keep running. You have to make everyone content. Congratulations. To all those from Panda Bhavan and the four arms of Madhuban. Congratulations, congratulations, congratulations. The double foreigners are seeing that Bab Dada hasn't said anything to them. 
बाप दादा ऑल द दादीज एंड ऑल द ब्राह्मीस हैव डबल एंड ट्रिपल लव फॉर द डबल फॉरनर्स वाई बाप दादा ऑलवेज रिलेट्स देअर स्पेशलिटी दैट दे हैव ब्रोकन थ्रू द वॉल्स ऑफ डिफरेंट कल्चर्स एंड कम टू द ब्राह्मीन लाइफ यू हैव बिकम दोज ऑफ द ब्राह्मीन कल्चर so that no one can even tell that you are from a different country you belong to your bharat and will constantly belong here this is why the double foreigners are given lots and lots of million and billion fold love and remembrance very good blessing may you be seated on a lotus seat and experience god's love by being detached from any awareness of bodies a lotus seat is a symbol of the elevated stages of brahmin souls souls who are seated on such a lotus seat are automatically detached from any awareness of bodies no awareness of bodies pulls them father brahma always had an angelic form or deity form in his awareness while walking and moving around in the same way when you have a natural soul conscious days you are said to be detached from having any awareness of bodies those who stay beyond any awareness of bodies are loved by god slogan is your specialties and virtues have been given to you by god as prabhu prasad and to consider them to be your own is to have body consciousness thank you baba om shanti